So today I'm going to make some crock pot baby food. And I've already chopped this. We had an issue with the chicken I bought yesterday. So I had to, I had to go return it and that's why this stuff looks brown. But it wasn't when I first cut it. Um, so I have golden beets, carrots, green beans, sweet potato, and plantains. And chicken. Um, the only thing here that is not organic is the plantains and I guess it's because they don't I haven't found them I looked at Whole Foods no organic plantains oh also I have butternut squash that I cheated and I bought it already chopped because I hate cutting it um, so I'm gonna put all that in the crock pot and I'll show you how I do it so I put the two chicken breasts at the bottom and I put the carrots it doesn't matter where you put the stuff um, basically the steam is gonna cook it and this is like the to me the best way to cook the baby food it's the easiest and then I'll show you how I shred it so these are the golden beets and put the plant we'll put the plant beans on top uh, we'll do the green beans here Sweet potatoes right here. And this is basically like a large batch. Um, I don't know how many of it will fit the butternut squash. So, I'm going to go plantains and butternut squash. So, then I add about a cup to a cup and a half of water. And then today, because it's already 6 p.m., uh, I'm going to set it on high, but I usually do low. And it'll cook for four hours, which means that I will be up past 10 o'clock. And, all right. And with the crock pot, since it traps the steam in, you don't really need a lot of water. So this is about, it's actually a little bit more than a cup. But that's from the baby bullet. So do that. Close it. And my crock pot's pretty old, but we're gonna put it on high. And that's it. So at about 10 o'clock, we will check it and see how it's doing. And now we blend.
Now you see that bowl back there? I actually, as I blend the vegetables, I add them to that bowl. And then when I'm done, I'll move them back into the crock pot and blend them with the emulsion blender. Uh, now chicken is actually the hardest thing to blend. Uh, so it requires a lot of liquid um, because it's, it's kind of dry. But this sage spoonfuls little blender attachment thing works really well. Look, it's 10.55. So see now I transferred everything from that bowl that you saw earlier back into the crock pot because it's deeper and the emulsion blender kind of makes a mess and I just stir it up until I'm done. It's kind of hard to do it one-handed while I'm trying to record. Now the color doesn't look that pretty, but trust me, it tastes way better than store-bought. Um, I even tasted it. It doesn't have salt or anything, any type of spices in it, but it tastes really good. This stuff is like lava, hence the owl. I date and label them. And there you have it, guys. A big batch of dinner sweet things.